Hello, and welcome back to Final Fantasy VII! Last time, we explored the tunnels under Midgar, and fought the Turks! And this time, we're going this way instead of the other way, uh, because the other way is where we want to be, but this is where we want to be, if that makes sense. Um, also, literally, as shown, also, literally the very last battle before I came back, because I was walking back and forth through the tunnels a bit, just getting from place to place, Cloud unlocked. Meteor Rain! So, you know, that'll be fun. Next time we get a chance to use it. But in the meantime, welcome to the Shinra building. I guess we'll take the stairs up again. Oh, hey, it's Katesy! Now, I'm sure you're asking yourself right now, Oh, Glob, I don't believe it. What are you seriously taking the stairs again? I actually have a reason. <laughs> like, legit. Um, there is a new item in here that I want, and it's better than an elixir. Thus, the stairs. Also, I don't actually know where, how deep in it is. So, I'm just going all the way out. Um, it might be cl really close to the top. Or it might not be. Uh, I, I legitimately do, do not know. Having said that, I'm not sure I'm going to make you watch me climb all the way up again, especially without witty dialogue on the parts of Barrett and Tifa. Hmm... Okay, well that's two. I'm going up to 60, right? So each one is probably around 10? Maybe... No, each one is more than... is less than 20. Or am I going to the 69th floor? So... 70? I don't know. Oh wait, I'm at, I'm at the top already. Where the hell was my item? Uh... I'm confused. Oh, hey, it's these guys! Murdered! I suppose Cloud doesn't need kills anymore either, but you know, with this class of enemy, I don't think it really matters. So I'm a little bit disappointed that I didn't see that item I wanted in the stairs, but at the same time, I feel like I just don't care that much. Okay, um, oh, I can't go all the way to the top, that's disappointing. Uh, but I can go to... 64. Let's see... Oh, hey, I can totally rest here, also. BANG! We got Mind Source, Speed Source! Cool. So that's why we hit it earlier in the game, incidentally. Uh, although, I believe there's also something in one of these lockers. One of them. Uh, there it is! The HP Shout! Behold! Uh... BEHOLD! THE MOST USELESS WEAPON IN THE GAME! Not really, well... Arguably. That is Kate Seath's ultimate weapon, and I can comfortably say it's his ultimate weapon, because even if he- because I'm never gonna use him again regardless. So as far as we're concerned, it is the last weapon he's gonna get. Um... Even if he gets another one, it's certainly the last weapon he'll use. Whether he uses it or not, uh... Okay, maybe my... Uh, anyway. <clears throat> uh, that one, as you might guess from the name, scales based on his current HP. Uh, so, I want that thing. The Glow Lance. Which I'm pretty sure is a weapon for Sid. Uh, I guess we'll look again. Yep. Don't know how good it is, but hey, we got it. Uh, now... 
I believe the only other thing that I want to do here, since apparently there was nothing in the stairs, hmm. but there should be something in the lobby. If you will recall... Oh hey, you know, I totally forgot to rest. I'll, I'll, ru I'll run up and do that off screen. Um, but, if you will recall, in the store here, which is currently abandoned, there were items! The Master Fist! And... The Pile Bunker! Okay, Master Fist is definitely a weapon for Kiva. What's the Pile Bunker? Uh... Banger. Whatever. It really sh powers up when condition changes. What? Let's look. Uh, no. That's a big no. Uh, how about Barrett's, though? Yeah, that is just strictly worse than the Max Ray. Like, why would you give this to me now? It deals less damage, it has no material growth, and it's a melee weapon! It's just junk! This at least might be okay, depending on how it powers up. I mean, I'm not going to use it because it's it, it's kind of ick, but there's the there's potential there, is what I'm saying. Uh, in any case, I'm going to meet you at the out train area we were at uh, at the end of last episode, right after our rest in the restroom. So, see you in a minute. And we're back. Worth mentioning is that I swapped Steel for Manipulate on Cloud. Not that I expect Manipulate to come in very useful, but I checked and there's basically nothing I care about stealing. Uh, at least in Midgar. We're definitely going to want Steel again for at least one or two more areas in the game, but not here. Oh yes, it's this thing! Uh, what's this thing again? It's big, that's for sure. Oh... It's you. AND YOU! I mean... It, Palmer's not competent, but at least he had his thing, right? Like. He was all about the space travel. He might have been bad at his job, but he was at least somewhat dedicated to it. So, you know, I'll give him props. I'll give him props for effort. These two, though, they're just terrible. I can't call them the worst, because that would be Hojo. But they are all the same, quite... Well, you know, terrible. I, I just said it, but I said it again. They deserve th they deserve it sp to be said twice. And he weep on artillery. Yeah, we'll see how that goes. How many weapons have we killed? Actually, none. Huh. I mean, we fought several weapons, but in cur but actually, every weapon that has thus far been killed has been killed mm, by the sister ray. <laughs> So, you know, figure that one out. Um, figure this thing out. Uh, I'm pretty sure you're weak against lightning. Uh, I'm pretty sure I want to use Big Guard. Maybe not. That didn't really do much. Um, right. So, I... D oh, two different targets. Let's bomb at zero this. It just occurred to me, I have Quattro Magic equipped onto freaking Toad. That is just wrong. <laughs> uh, wait, has Barrett gone? He is not! We are gonna mimic Bahamut Zero. This is gonna happen. Just watch it. It might be a little bit time consuming, but it's gonna be awesome. Hmm. Okay, a lot time consuming. I really wish 
there was like a fast forward or skip button for some in animations. I've got to be honest. Maybe I'm just spoiled by um, Pile Heart, but having a button to skip animations is just terrific. Mime! Go! Don't counterattack. Thank you, Barrett. Thank you for not counterattacking. Uh. Let's see. I think Bio's not gonna do anything to a robot. So, I guess we'll just try it. You know, a minute from now, when this animation finishes. Oh well. At least it looks cool. Although, I gotta say. Hmm. has always been one of the Final Fantasy summons that, well, actually, wait, no, is that true? I was gonna say that Bomb's always been one of the more mechanically inclined ones, like one of the more robot -y summons. But I don't think that actually started until this game. Because it's totally true with 7 and onward, but... Before now, he was totally just a dragon. Uh, albeit a really cool dragon. But a dragon. Yeah, definitely weak against lightning. Man, I'm gonna murder you. I mean, honestly, I can mind try and save myself the MP. I don't even care if I accidentally uh, copy Barret. It's not a big deal. Uh, copies can. Oh, okay, that's doing a lot less damage now. Uh. I almost wish I had used put scan instead of manipulate. Almost. No, that was still tons. Unless it's just overlapping weird. Or maybe it just failed with mine. Oh, oh hey, we killed a part. Okay, uh, I guess we'll use trying some more. This thing is just such a pushover. Um, although, I should be careful with my MP consumption now that I think about it. Oh wait, that is definitely only 700. So I guess the... I guess that part resists it. But the outside part was weak. That seems probable. I guess we'll use Death Blow then. Hmm. What was it saying? Right. I do actually... I actually should be a little bit careful with my MP consumption. Because... There's more coming after this guy. Uh, and it would... I don't remember how difficult that fight is. I don't remember it being... Well, what little I do remember, I don't remember it being too hard. Mostly I remember using a lot of stage effects, actually. Uh, which, you know, Ribbon. That's what it's for. Uh -huh. But I digress. Brave Claude is not really that much of a threat. Would be nice if it gave me a limit break, though. I mean, both Barrett and Cloud do need to get those last few limit breaks out. Hmm. Actually, contrary to what I said last episode, I think it was last episode, I might end up showing Cloud's penultimate limit break, but there's no way that's happening for anyone else. Well, actually, no, that's not true either. We'll totally get to see Tifa's just because of the mechanics of how her limit breaks work. But Barrett, Red, Sid, uh... Vincent, and even Aerith, actually. Literally everyone else. Except for Cloud and, I guess, technically Katesy. Uh. Oi, since when does Katesy get preference? There's something wrong with that picture. But it's, but it's because he only has two long breaks in the first place. I will say this. 
Crowd Cloud might be a pushover, but it does have a lot of HP. And there's not really much I can do to speed this up, seemingly. Uh, maybe if I had scan, I could see if it was weak against anything. Or maybe I could have just, l or maybe I could have bothered to check if it was weak against anything ahead of time. Because clearly that didn't happen. Um, oh hey, I don't know, let's try better. Maybe we get lucky. So I think it's, it might, well, it was a little bit better than trying anyway. How about Aqua Breath? I mean, I could just summon something on him, but as I, as I said before, I don't know, how many tents do I have? I'm not sure if I've bought a single tent this whole game, so. I have five. I mean, that might be enough, to be honest. Uh, more Bahamut? I don't know. Honestly, that wasn't even that bad. It didn't even give anyone a limit brick. I mean, come on. I'm using, I am using level three cure, but only because Barrett has so much HP, and he's been tanking a lot. I mean, I knew it. His chest is totally see-through. That is so weird. Oh, hey. I guess we did it. Uh. Okay, at least two restores are burned. We're burned? Born. I have a level 3 all again, I think. I have full life. A lot of money. Seriously, that's, that's gotta be enough money for, like, four whole Chocobo Greens. And the Ragnarok! Which is the real prize, I think. Unfortunately, I can't do anything with those new restores I got. Because restore is the one materia where I actually want it mastered, basically. Like, where I want an equipped with one mastered, that is. Basically what I'm saying is one access to cure three. Anyway, we did it! Yay! Okay, so, um, let's see. I don't know what else was mastered, because I'll of all those cures. Quattro magic. Oi. Uh, so yeah, that's mastered. That's also mastered. Mastered. Figured. Um, cover is almost there. Um, I'm not sure whether or not I'll keep a mastered cover on him or not. That one's iffy. I would probably keep a mastered counterattack, but I might swap to the new cover. I guess we'll see when it happens. I mean, it's gonna happen pretty soon, so. HP Plus isn't that far off either, actually. Hmm. Uh. All it really does is get. It levels so quickly. Hmm. I guess I could have used Alexander for the MP Absorb. Uh, anyway. Uh, the Ragnarok. Let's check that out. Obviously, it's a weapon for Cloud. It's a pretty good one. Uh, slightly more powerful and more accurate than the current one, but with links. I mean, an improvement is an improvement. I think that actually might be Cloud's second or third best sword in the game? I suppose it depends how you count them. I know for a fact that Cloud gets a triple AP growth weapon, for instance. But anyway, Elixir! Missed up. What the hell is that? Uh, it's armor, apparently. Well, that's okay, I guess. It might be better than... It's probably not better than the... Well... Well, actually. If I don't care about the nullification from the Minerva Band, it is better than the Minerva Band. How about this? Also better than this. Well, you have the Tetra Elemental on you. So... I think I will swap that. 
you're my tank anyway, so it makes sense for you to have extra defenses. Now. Oh, I guess we're fighting something. Actually, it's a big tank! As opposed to this- oh, wow. Um... Oh, hey! Satellite beam! It's a big tank with, like, a whole lot of guns on it, I guess. Well... A whole lot less now. Okay, I gotta say, I don't think tanks bend that way. Uh, that did actually hurt a fair amount, though. Uh, well, three out of four. That's, that seems to be my average. Well, that'll probably kill it. And on that note, as I was in the process of saying before... Oh, worth a lot of experience, though. I think for the first... For quite possibly the first time in the whole damn game, let's use a tent. Full heal. Uh, also, while, while, while I'm in here. And on that note, I think we'll stop up here. Join me next time when we stop the Shinra Cannon for good! Or the Sister Ray, or the Mid- or the Macro Cannon, you know, whatever you want to call it. We'll be stopping it. Bye! <laughs>